Okay, welcome, welcome everyone to Naked Safari Naked Media. And today I have uh, one of our very special guests. Who are working with the Arava Institute for Environmental Studies and the Elate Lote Renewable Energy Initiative. We want to have the experience of what it's like to work in an off-grid situation, yes. you know? In a real situation. In a real situation, real you know? Yeah. You know you know maybe Kenya much more than I know yes, Kenya, you know? <laughs> uh, I was raised in South Africa, so I had I was fortunate to, to see how the people are living. Mm -hmm. And you know, and when you spend a little bit of time, you know, living in this in with people, you learn you learn their the problems, yeah, you learn the, the reality of yes. you know? And so so here we made a situation where uh, students, you know, who are coming from everywhere. From, from Europe, from America, from Israel, from Kenya, can everybody can come together, that they can share their ideas. But we made a place that, to show what, to show what the situation might look like, just yeah. to feel it, you know? Like a model. Mm -hmm. Exactly that. And then also, but it's also a living model and it's a laboratory. Mm -hmm. Because at the end of the day, we have guys, students, that come with these ideas, they make this, like this is for biogas. We have another system over there for water. He's purifying ah, the yes, water, okay? The water. So, and then we want to use that water, the purified water over there for, for the agriculture. For agriculture. So we're making this system economy. System like a... Mm -hmm. a closed economy, exactly. Mm -hmm. yes. You know, so, so if we can make the sustainable yeah. system, um, we can see what works, what doesn't work. Because look, sometimes things don't work. Yeah. Yeah. And, and that's yeah. okay, and that's okay. We want to see if it breaks. Why? Why did it break? Maybe we make it stronger, maybe we make it simpler. We try these different things, but we must play. Failing is good. So we make this living where laboratory. You from. Yeah. So we can play, we can try, and then every once in a while we have some superstars they break through. They they, yes, they get it right. Boom, the market. And then and then from here we use it as the, the, the to show the people, to train the people, to try to experiment. And then from here it goes we we export it to Africa. So we're working together yeah. with the, with the, the Arava Institute yes. and the Renewable Energy Administration of Elate Lot here. We work together and we made another company called K-Lot. Okay? K-Lot. A lot, where we are, yeah. and Kenya. Kenya! Ah, <laughs> K-Lot. Oh. So ah, that's a good one. <laughs> so, so after the technologies have been developed here and we, we show them and they, we know that they work, then we go to Kenya. And ah. we have a distribution center and training center in Kenya uh, that all of the technologies that we see here yeah. are uh, distributed there. And a few years ago they started, mm -hmm. they started the first, they sent the first guy and they say, you know, go, whoa, whoa. Yes. you know, he was like, <laughs> <laughs> what to do? <laughs> and then, uh, and then, and now it's going for two years now, now they're, uh, now they're starting to grow the team, now they're starting to get mm -hmm. A little bit. They're starting to understand where they are, how yeah. things work, yeah. and then now they're starting to go. But they 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 they're working with local people. Uh, they're getting into the villages with the local farmers. They yeah. they uh, so th so they're working with people who who will use the biogas. So it's like uh, households and farms. People who use the water technologies also yeah. households yeah. and farms. So they're talking with you. Also, they have a, a technologies for milk, for yeah. for for for, for milk the cows. The cows. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because we understand that. It's a big part of the people's income, is the yeah. milk. But also, they... Well, especially the pastures in Kenya, like they have uh, 200 cows, yeah. and maybe 15 or 20 maybe lactating at the same time. Right, right. So... And, and, also, and, also they, and also we understand that some, um, some, some, uh, some people have like 15 cows or, or 100 cows, yeah. and, and they can't all have one big truck, it doesn't, so then they make a big co-op. Cooperations ah, over like there. Ah, cooperation. Mm. So like a milk circle. We call yeah. them milk circles. Milk circles. And, and this, company, this company, when you, when you go to Kenya, does it work with um, like the expert? You, do you bring the expert from Israel or you work with the local expert? Look, now there's, we, we will do all of it. At yeah. the beginning, we yeah. start off with, uh, with the things that we know and yeah. we go to there. But now we're opening up and we're trying to understand how can we work more with local people. And I think this is yeah. the next stage. Uh -huh. I'm having a meeting tonight with one of our partners uh, and we're going to be talking about how do we work better exactly with, with local people so this, this is a part of the thing yeah. but I think you guys um, because of your because you're ex-alumni I must connect you guys up yeah. and you're